Thanks to the recent Supreme Court decision allowing medical cannabis patients to use edibles and oils, insurance companies may start covering the plant like other prescribed medications. After the Supreme Court ruling, Health Canada announced that licensed cannabis producers can now sell oil in addition to the dry bud they already offer. Experts say this change is a step towards legitimizing cannabis in the eyes of the medical community. This is because the cannabinoid content of oil is more consistent, dosages are more precise, and oil can be put into capsules instead of smoked. According to Bruce Linton from Tweed Marijuana, when something doesn't look different than other medicines, it becomes much easier for people to get comfortable with the idea that this is, in fact, a possible treatment option for patients. The biggest obstacle to cannabis being covered by insurance companies is that the plant doesn't have a drug identification number. Wendy Hope, a spokesperson for the Canadian Life and Health Insurance Association, said if cannabis was issued a drug ID number from Health Canada, insurance companies would most likely cover it. Health Canada says cannabis isn't considered a medicine because it hasn't undergone vigorous trials like other drugs. According to Kuram Malik, an analyst at Jacob Securities, this is sure to quickly change. Quote, you're going to see a lot of Canadian companies partnering up with universities overseas that are a little more progressive than the ones we have here, at least in this space, to drive this research forward and legitimize it in the eyes of doctors and get DIN numbers on these things. Furthermore, Malik says that insurance companies would probably prefer to pay for cannabis as it's less expensive than prescription drugs.